Hi guys, hope you're all well. If you're new to Siege Studios, we're a premium miniature painting service with over 30 artists. Here at Siege we offer four painting levels, ranging from our bronze, premium gaming quality, up to our platinum competition standard. For your free quote today, follow the link in the description of this video. The Disciple of the Changer of Ways graces our presence today, guys, in this awesome character showcase which we have for you. We have Kairos, Fate Weaver, Zinch Demon, uh, for you guys to check out which we've had the pleasure of working on and it's been painted by Adam one of the artists here at Siege. This model is absolutely covered in non-metallic metal golds, silvers and coppers. It has loads of freehand textures and also freehand designs and intricacies across it so be prepared because this one is an absolute watch the whole way through. Um, so let's dive right in and have a look at Kairos in all his glory. Um, now Adam has approached this with loads of little details across all the areas of the model and uh, just to start off with the areas on top, we've got this awesome free-handed sort of spell book that he's got. And that's before we obviously look at all the free-handed stars and details on the wings. Uh, but you can see that Ad's done a great job of just picking up all of the little details on the model. You've got every single little bit, if I just grab the miniature and get it a bit closer for you. Uh, you can see all the little intricate sort of runes and spells. I particularly like the uh, sort of... Um, the, the iron or the refraction of light on the actual pages as well. And uh, I really do the, like the little trident as well. <laughs> it's just uh, the cheeky little trident that's on the book, which is just great. Uh, so that's just one of the freehand details on the model. Um, Obviously, looking at all the wings and everything here, you can see uh, we've got obviously all these free-handed stars in this kind of non-metallic metal golden kind of glistening, which is really lovely. Uh, and if we move around the back, so you can see from the rear view, you can see all of the little details and stars and sort of little twinkles and things that have just been added across the wings to make them look very etheric, uh, which just works extremely well. I do love these two extra little details here with this lovely color transition just on these as well, which I think works really nicely. Um, if I raise the model to the to just look from behind, you can see obviously all the hide and skin and everything that's been painted in these lovely blues. Um, really nice darker kind of palette on this as well. Uh, kind of keeps with the uh, sort of evil vibe of Kairos, which I think is just really cool. Um, so starting off with the uh, sort of armored areas of uh, the demon you've got uh, these sort of little sort of uh, sort of anklets and things that he's got obviously in full non-metallic metal copper if we just get that a bit closer you can see you can see it obviously you see all the little gems and everything that are fully done all the blending and uh, attention to detail that's been lavished across obviously all those areas on the uh, tabard you've got all this texture as well which you'll see around the front when you look at the front view um, but there's just so much to look at on this model and obviously you've got the sword here that's just been sort of buried into the ground as well with the blade all the little runes and gems and everything all fully painted really nice uh, non-metallic metal silver on there with nice attention to detail of the uh of the uh, sort of wornness of it on the uh, sort of handle and uh, obviously all the metals have got like nice dirt work done to them as well just to really make them look a bit grubby and things uh, not pristine for him uh, and then if we move around just move the model forward you can see uh, all the little veins and things picked out in a nice uh, picked out in a nice complimentary pink and uh, which just works really really nicely and just denotes them on the miniature I love all the veins on the sort of neck for here for example and on the thighs and legs and just uh, areas of muscular structure of the miniature and then we'll move around to the front and have a look at starting to look at some of these heads and things so we, we can't uh, sort of ignore his kind of like stave kind of thing that he's got with all this green energy just uh, billowing around you can see all the non-metallic metal gold that's just been done on there um, and then moving around you can see the extra copper work there so you've got some obviously non-metallic gold here non-metallic copper there plus also little bits of silver scattered around on the model as well which is really cool with the first of the two heads of kairos this one's got some eyes just sort of coming out of his tongue which is pretty normal i suppose for a, for a zinch demon uh and then <laughs> <laughs> his other head has got obviously he's just being a bit rude and sticking his tongue out and you can see that texture that's just been painted and all the little sort of details of the tongue that's been painted on there but every little bit of armor across the miniature done in that sort of copper nmm or non-metallic metal uh, with all the gems and runes and things all done in lovely reds and greens in some scattering as well which just works quite nicely do really like the attention to the hide and skin on sort of like the legs and feet as well really nice color palette on there um, and you can just see all the little details really painstakingly painted and absolutely tens and tens of hours spent on this miniature in itself for our client um, and again just moving around you can see the little tassels and things just hanging off of the uh, sort of uh, stave here that the book is on all done in uh, in obviously non-metallic metal uh, sort of gold uh, so you just you can see that 
if we look at this awesome stave just because the model is so big i'm trying to get it all on camera in one view you can see the lovely transition of color on there just to show this kind of etheric kind of glow on this kind of like copper or gold which is really cool and i love all of these little green uh little green little rune stones just uh, scattered around on the stave as well which is cool so if we have a look at his uh sort of uh, buckle kind of thing you've got this awesome red eye surrounded by loads of uh non-metallic metal copper um and then you've got a lovely skull just hanging down on there and then we've got this awesome free-handed non-metallic metal design on the tabard as well which is just lovely and if we just really get this to focus for you guys so you can see obviously all the texture and everything that's been painted on plus this awesome free-handed design that's just been put on there which just works extremely well uh, again a really really lovely lovely attention to detail on the model uh, but overall an incredible incredible model which i do hope you guys have loved looking at in this video uh, we've got more photos of this model on our website along with all the other projects we do so do go and check out our website um, and this is a really good example of how we specialize in characters and also the quality that you get here with us at siege for our platinum level so do hope that you liked it ever so much this guy is now off to go and change some ways and make some devious little tricks and uh, magical events happen so I do hope that you liked him ever so much and I'll see you very soon on the next one So thanks for watching the video guys, I hope that you have enjoyed it. While you're here on YouTube, help us out by subscribing to the Siege channel. We upload at least three videos a week, so make sure you hit that bell icon to be notified when a new video is live. To see more, go follow us on our other social media where you can keep up to date with what we get up to and interact with us. If you're looking to learn from us, we offer online tuition on Patreon and physical classes nationally in the UK. Finally, to get your free quote today, click the link in the description of this video. From all the team here at Siege and myself, a massive thank you for watching the video and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.